What's up, YouTube fam, and welcome back to the channel. It's your girl, Gabrielle, also known as Gabby, back with another cash stuffing video for you guys today. We're gonna be cash stuffing my paycheck too for the month of August. Super excited to get into it, as always, as our cash envelopes are on E. If you are new here, welcome to my channel. My name is Gabrielle. I do a lot of things to do with cash envelope system, just stuffing our cash envelopes. I'm currently on a debt-free journey to pay off about $22,000 this year, currently participating in savings challenges to save $5,000 this year. So if you're interested in all of those budgeting things, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. I would love to have you in my community. And if you are coming back, thank you so much for coming back to my channel. Guys, without further ado, let's go ahead and hop on into the video. Um, I'm gonna get my binders out of the way. You guys know I like to budget first. So I'm going to bring out my budget, my new cash stuffing kit that I created that I'm excited about. And we're gonna chat it up about the budget. All right, guys, we are back with the cash stuffing kit all set up, all filled in for you just to save a little time. I'll be giving you a few more details about it just because I didn't get to everything last week. So let's go ahead and get into this income. So income this week is gonna be paycheck two and we got a total amount of $1,699. The reason I built this cash stuffing kit this way and just listed the income because every cash stuffing, I don't only stuff a paycheck. So the paycheck budget really wasn't working for me. I would have other income coming in. Like we have the child tax credit. We have so many other income side hustles and so forth. So that is what that is. But today what we're working with is $1,699. Guys, this is my paycheck. I did get my yearly raise for my performance evaluation and it came out to about an extra $60 each pay period, which is about $120 a month. Not bad at all. For me, what I did guys was I went ahead and upped my 401k balance, not balance, my 401k contribution by 2%. I had only planned to do it by 1%, but it didn't eat up the full amount. It only ate up half of it. So, and by ate up, I mean, <laughs> it took it out of my paycheck so I don't see it anymore. So what I did was I went ahead and upped it to 2%. My goal this year um, was to be at 10%, but now I'm going to be at 11%. So I'm happy with that. And I am still sticking to the same standard 11. So back, it's gonna go back down to what I was making before, which is awesome. Just not inflating and spending that extra 120, even though I very, very well like to do that. But um, so that is that. $16.99 is what we're working with. First, I like, next I like to go up to my digital expenses. And this is everything that I keep in my bank account online. And I use my debit card, credit card, whatever to pay for this. So what we have today for digital expenses is going to be cable and internet for 210. Life insurance is gonna be 150. Car loan two is gonna be $440. Investing is gonna be 110. Gas, $100. Personal, we're putting 150 and that's gonna be online. That's our personal spending money. And debit, debit, debt snowball is going to be $149 that we're gonna put towards our next debt, which is our car loan too. So all of that comes out to the total amount of $1,309. So after, if we subtract the $1,309 the from the $1,699, we will have a remaining balance of $390. And this is what I use to fund all of my cash envelopes down here. So today for cash envelopes, what we have is 165 is going towards groceries. Um, I normally have eating out in here, but last week I stuffed eating out for two weeks, guys, and we completely spent all of it. So this week we're just gonna have to tough it out. If we wanna eat out, we're gonna have to use some of our personal money to, to, to eat out. So um, next is gonna be beauty, and beauty is gonna get $50. We already have $60 in that cash envelopes. I did want to put the start here so that I can keep better track of my envelopes each time I stuff. So basically what I do is before I stuff my envelopes, I want I go through and see how much money I have in all of these envelopes and then come up with the amount that I'm going to add. So next is spending. Spending is getting $50 and saving challenge is going to get 105. And these are the bulk of my variable cash envelopes. Anything with stars beside it is going to be our sinking funds. And sinking funds, guys, is not getting much today. It's going to get a total amount of $20. Um, 
because we had a tight month this month. So sinky funds are taking a hit this month, not getting stuff this much. And all of this equals out to $390 as well. And I will update the ending amounts once I get them stuffed. So that is all for the cash stuffing kit. I hope you guys understand my, you know, rhyme and reason behind how I do everything. Just, I don't know. I just like it laid out so that I can see it and I can understand it a lot better. So without further ado, let's go ahead and switch over to our cash stuffing portion of the video. Okay, guys, we are back and ready to attack. Let's count this cash. Make sure we have $390. Get in our cash tray and get these envelopes stuffed so your girl can start the rest of her week, okay? <laughs> So let's see what we have. We have 100, 200, 250, 270, 290, 310, 330, 350, 360, 370, 375, 380, 381, 82, 83, 84, 85, 86, 87, 88, 89, and 390. So we do have all of our coins ready to be stuffed. So let me get in the cash tray real quick. All right, let's open up our binder and get ready to get these things stuffed. First, we're going to start with groceries. And groceries today is going to get $165. So I'm going to take 100 and I'm going to take 20, 65. So 165. And there is nothing in groceries, as you can see. So let's make sure it's 165, 120, 40, 65. So 165 is going in groceries. And we barely made it by the skin of our teeth. I was so happy to get our envelopes back stuffed today. Next is going to be eating out and eating out is going to get nothing guys. If we want to eat out, we're going to have to use our personal money just because we spent all of it last week and I had doubled it guys. I doubled it for two weeks. So crazy. If it's there, we're going to spend it. Beauty today is going to get 50 and I think we already have $60 left in there. We spent a little bit. I think my husband got like a haircut and so forth. So we're going to take a 50. So we'll have 110 in beauty. And I really want to get my nails done, guys, as you can see. But there's just not enough time in the day with me adjusting to my new schedule and all that. Things have been on the back burner. <laughs> self-care as so next is going to be spending and this is my husband for his pocket money and he'll have two 20s and a 10 he'll get 50 dollars. he gets about 50 a week to spend frivolously so 20 40 and 50 and next one is girls that only gets stuff with our child tax credit money and at, the, at this point um we don't have any so um, you know, I want to see how much is in here. I actually have 121 in there, which is awesome. And I'm probably going to use a lot of this money, guys, from this month. I think I'm putting 200 in here for back to school for my girls. So back to school is starting up next month for us. I know a lot of people have already started back to school, but in the East Coast where I live, we, only, we don't start until after Labor Day. So that's that. Next is going to be our saving challenge, the big the big one, the big one. And we always put 105 in in our savings challenge each week. So $105. I'll take that. And let's count it up and see what we have. We have 1,000, 2,000, 100, 200, 300, 400, 500, 600, 700, 800, 900, 950, 3,000 dollars. So we have 3,020. 40, 60, 80, 120, no, 100, 120, 25, 26, 27. So let's count this real quick. So we do have 3,000, 20, 40, 60, 80, 100, 120, 125, 126, 127. So $3,127 in our savings challenge. And this month I am definitely will be doing a cash exchange and getting, um, another 1k slip in here which i don't even know if i have any more 1k slips i think i'm gonna have to get rid of my lasik envelope um because you know we're not even using i'm not stuffing it or anything so that is all for the louis vuitton faux binder and we're gonna move on to my glittery rose gold binder where we will stuff some of our 
sinking funds, guys. And sinking funds are not getting much, guys. I have the dollars. Shout out to the Crafty Budgeter. I have the dollars today for the sinking funds. You know, it's, it's hard out here, but the dollars add up. So neither here nor there. Christmas today is going to get $10. This is going to get the most just because I need to start. I need to get serious about Christmas, guys. I really do. It's 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 around the corner. So I'll just take the 10 and add it in. See what we have for the ending total. We have 100, 200, 300, 350, 370, 380, 385. So 385 in Christmas. And if I don't start stuffing this, it's going to be a pretty small Christmas around here. And next is going to be car maintenance. Car maintenance is getting a dollar today. Let's get a dollar. So we have 220, 221 in car maintenance. And like I said, my husband is trying to do some stuff with the cars, but we have to beat this back up because we spent a lot of money on getting parts for the car with my little accident I had, as well as oil changes and so forth. Next is gonna be vacation. Vacation today is going to get a dollar. And we have $80 in vacation, so that'll bring us to $81, $50, $70, $80, $81. In vacation, clothing is going to get a dollar as well. And let's see what we have in clothing, $20, $40, $55, and $56. So clothing is going to be $56. And I need to go shopping, but not... I'm 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 so terrible when it comes to shopping. I I just don't I don't want to go. I don't want to go. It's not the funnest experience. The way things look on like the you know hanger does not look how <laughs> it's not how it looks on my body. But I really need to go shopping. Just take a whole day and go. So at some point I will. LASIK is my LASIK surgery, guys. I already have three thousand put to the side for that. I will just skip over this one today. It's not getting anything for a while. I'm hoping that by the beginning of next year, I can get started getting ready to have that surgery. So gifts, guys, is going to get a dollar today as well. And let's see, we have in there 50, 71, 72, and we'll have $73 in gifts. And I have one more gift to get this month. I already got two for some little people in our lives. So that is it for gifts. Home improvement is going to get $2 today. <laughs> because I don't have anything in home improvement. I haven't stuffed home improvement this month, I don't think. So 21 and 22 is what we have in home improvement. Need to bulk that up too, because we have some projects we wanna do, especially since we're staying where we are. Birthday is going to get $1 today. Did I put one or $2 in home improvement? Yes, I put two. Perfect. Okay. Birthday is going to get a dollar. And that is my birthday trip that I am planning. So hopefully everything works out. 120, 40, 60, 80, 85, 86, 87, 88, 89, and 90. So 190 dollars in yeah, in birthday. And guys, we had an issue with our flights when we went to California and we got a voucher for $50 towards our next flight, me and my husband. So we think we're gonna use that to go on my birthday trip. I just gotta secure a babysitter and all that stuff. So bear with me guys. Birthday is done. Electronics is gonna get a dollar today as well. So we have a lot of extra electronics guys. I told you I came into a little extra money for the month last month at the end of the month last month and i put a little extra in here so electronics should have 957 according to my thing and will be it'll be 958 so let's see 100 200 300 400 500 600 700 800 900 950 955 56 57 and 58 so 958 for electronics getting getting pretty close guys if i come into some more extra money i'm just gonna throw it in here i'm super excited to get my ipad even though now that I'm back to work, I'm like, I probably won't have much time to play around on it because when I'm home after work, I have to get to the kids, get to dinner, get, to, you know, it's just not enough time, guys. So neither here nor there, just me venting. Miscellaneous is up next and that is going to get $2 and that's going to be the last one we're going to be stuffing today. 
And I think it already has 14. So 1, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. So $16. And this is basically for ice cream when the ice cream truck comes. <laughs> basically, that's what I've been using it for. And little miscellaneous things that I might need to pick up for the kids. Yada, yada. So that is it. You guys know money with Gab as well as taxes does not get stuffed unless I get some side hustle income from YouTube. Shout out to you guys for continuing to watch my videos, getting me a little YouTube revenue. I appreciate it so much. Guys, that is it and that is all. If you have not already, go ahead and subscribe to the channel. And if you didn't know, we do have a giveaway going on. Go ahead and comment subscribe to all the ladies i will link a uh, leave a link down um i'll leave a link down below for all the the giveaway vi uh, videos and so forth so that you guys can participate that is all i have for you guys today i will see you guys possibly this weekend i want to do a little check-in but we'll see how that goes and chat with you guys so thanks so much for continuing to support me and i will see you guys next time bye guys